Welcome back, everyone, to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mucklover, with, of course, 5.0 update. Ashes to Embers, which we're playing as the Sisters of Steel. Now, we ended the last time, uh, well, not knowing that we'd end up going to war with them. I kind of figured we would, but, you know, it is what it is. I did get a comment from the last video saying that we should try out the Haven Path sometime, and we will. There's a Haven Path, and it's a lot of fun, but uh, we'll get there. I promise you we'll get there. We definitely, definitely, definitely will get there. Uh, in the meantime, um, we're going to try to do okay. There's no guarantees for us to do okay. I'm considering, hmm, you know what? How many divisions got? 9 and 20. You know what? Let's call them in. I was thinking that maybe we could make a couple encirclements here, maybe. Go in, you know, destroy a couple divisions here and there. Of course, we want our allies to fight. And they, Cult of Liberty, they die along the way. You know, it is what it is. It, you know, it's fine. But hope you're having a pretty good day yourselves. I'm doing okay myself, as we are... Of course, enjoying Old World Blues, because who does not love Old World Blues? Haters don't like Old World Blues, and they're wrong. You know, I don't know that many people who actually don't like Old World Blues, because it's a fantastic mod. Special Forces, yes please. Pain Train? Oh, oh yeah, actually more we could put on here too. Sniper, Awareness, Survivalist, Life Giver. Fast Recovering, uh, Soldiers, yes please. There you go. Um, I don't need all three of you to do this, so... Go to Highwood? Yeah, you can go there, maybe. Ah, oh, beautiful. Ah, oh, even better. So we're here to encircle. Encircle and destroy. That's the name of the game right now. I want you back up here. Oh, no, you go here. I want you... You go here. Especially for technology? Sure, why not? So we just keep taking more territory. And do whatever we can to encircle them. Down here. They're fighting a group down here. Which is okay. Could we do this? That would be nice. Um, they're starting to get too spread out. That division is destroyed. Fantastic. Love it, love it, love it. They're starting to lose a little bit here and there. Um, honestly, I want to send you back. I'd rather focus on destroying divisions right now than anything else, yes. Triplane attackers are very good. Ooh, I've got one, huh? That is quite unfortunate. How are you here? You're all going to fight them. Barrage balloons? Sure, why not? Have some fun with it. Max that out, please. Uh, make it some savings, which is fine, as we're shouting them down. As Paladin uh, Rejic once taught many of our initiates, yelling and shouting can often have quite the effect on the development as effective soldiers. Power armor training. Many of our promoted individuals within the Brotherhood have never seen extensive time in a suit of power armor. If we want more baseline training, we're going to need more to acclimate them. Acclimate them. Very true. Makes perfect sense. Um, power armor charge, because I do want better production costs. You want my thoughts on these idiots? Tell them they don't need to be running like it's a gosh darn marathon all the time. And they keep at it, they're going to wear down the fusion cores before the Enclave can even meet them. From Paladin Haven. Oh, this, yes. Oh, yes, please. Um, here. Uh, they'll probably get there before us. Yes, that's what I thought. It's not the end of the world. Just go around them, then. Oh, hello. Well. There you go. Go have fun. Oh. Okay, then. Not what I expected when they were doing this. Battle for Hoover Dam. Alrighty, tidy. Uh, sh sure, we'll go there. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. But well, we do have a cup of tea here to keep us nice and toasted. Or refresh, we should really say. And are we there yet? Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Hold. Beat him up. Beat him up. Oh, good. They got down there. That's good. Yeah. You know what? Go, go here and do that. That would help out. Meantime. Yes, please. Go old world wall hold, which it always pretty much does. Nice. At this point, just go ahead. It looks like we're doing pretty darn well, I'm not going to lie. Power armor training. Power armor charge. Power armor patcher. Listen up, recruits. Here's a power armor maintenance hack those stick up the Yahoo will disagree with. Dented helms? Cracked pa pauldrons? Just grab some scrap metal, slap that baby on, and treat yourself to new paint over. From Paladin Minerva. Please don't do that. Don't make me beg. Uh, from Elder Patroculus. Very nice. Oh, uh, sure. Yeah, I'll take some bicycles, I guess. 
We go to Lincoln. Good. Good. I think we've got him for this campaign. Go here. Not sure why you're trying to reinvent the wheel pretty much. Man of Prospectors? Why not? And we're out of money. Happened. Um, Chief of the Army, Paladin Minerva. Uh, I mean, a grizzled veteran of some of the smaller brother campaigns in and around Missouri. Well, a former raider. She acclimated mostly well to the brother lifestyle, forging questionably close connections to others within the support parted Sisters of Steel. Obsessing with the artistry of combat and fighting style, she was made for an excellent trainer for both experienced and inexperienced personnel, in part due to her great knowledge and in other thanks to her ever-present welcoming mood. Well, I guess we'll have to go with her. I guess that makes sense for us. We're not waiting on that. Well, let's keep him busy. I know we're not, we don't have the most power armor here, but still. We'll see. Go. Oh, ladies, it's fine, whatever. Barrage balloon's nice. Ooh, we are running out of manpower, aren't we? Hey, we're actually winning. Look at that. Fantastic. Power armor, you have power armor, even though I guarantee you they got better power armor than us. It's alright. Nice. There you go. See what you can do there. Missoula. Have I been there? Maybe I have. Maybe I haven't. Nice. Go to Y. Hey, and there you go. Hey, this was actually way better than I thought it would be. Nice. Take everything we could? I think so. If everyone's gonna get angry at us, hopefully not. Hey, that's pretty good. We did it. Go and train too. Um, in the meantime, what else do we need? Manage subjects. Ooh, we could probably annex them eventually. Cult of Liberty, Brotherhood, Dependency. So that'll be good for power armor. Mm hmm. So now we can do Among the Roses. All core land, more, way more compliance, less stability. Enclave auxiliaries will be drafted to serve the chapter, further gaining compliance boots in all of the MacArthur Department Detachment Territory, or no one wins in Scorched Fields. We own it. Moves the capital there. Head in the clouds log. I was naive to think that this would end any other way. But as we pay out of reach for the moon, we fell upon a star. MacArthur's Air Force Base makes perfect for a mountain stronghold, resilient against elements and all threats. Or we'll purpose it straight away. Or we can do this one. We get Cloud's Haven. This is all beyond my wildest dreams. I wonder what Patroclus would think if he saw us now. Standing side by side with an enemy we came to know through a nightmare. I promised my sisters I would see them through this land. Our dream, once a fickle seed, has flourished like a rose from the vine. And we still have so much more to do. I kind of want to see what this would be do. Because this seems more like, oh, this is really tough and you might not be able to get all the land of uh, MacArthur. This one's like, oh, you, maybe you won. Maybe you won. I kind of like this one, though. Even though this is, this is, the other one's better for resources, I want to see what the other one's like, so... Who are we going to war with? Oh, the historians. Oh, finally the historians. Okay. Cool. I'm okay with that. There you go. What are we missing besides manpower? Oh my god, do we need manpower? We were missing a lot of manpower, aren't we? And then what? Um, do we get any political power? Would be nice. Melee weaponry. A lot of, a lot of political power. Church of the Silos. Living Stone. I want cores. Can we get cores at all? Division organization speed, encryption. A research slot would be fantastic, really. Sophisticated electronics. Getting claims on all of Montana and Washington. I love that. Let's go for a better future first, though. Night Threat has gathered a small team of researchers and weaponsmiths. They propose a project to advance our melee weaponry. If it doesn't work, we'll certainly learn from it. Uh, Threat remarked. If it does, say, honor. Uh, how do you feel about an explosive sword? Reavers and new coats. With our expanding influence, the Reavers have approached us with another material request. But success has them dreaming bigger. Let us fulfill these wishes. Well, 
Why don't we do this? Well, they don't attack us. H Hello! Oh, we might be picking up a bigger fight than we initially uh, thought of. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Sure, yeah. Come on, come work with us. Uh, we need map so we're gonna grab that one next. Whose land? Might be going to war with them too. Can we actually support a war against these guys? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Standing Rock? I mean, potentially. I'm thinking my piece and more, actually. Hawkeye? Is this like Iowa or something? Can I take more? No. Uh, there you go. Nice. in case. Right, line up all the way. Oh, 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 it's getting ugly. There you go. Among the roses. Way more compliance. This is very nice. For a better future, of course. Oh! Oh, we got the auxiliaries. Um, that's nice. Enclave Remnants. Twelve and a half. Power of Platoon. I'd rather the Sisters of Steel. Because as much as I love the actual Enclave Divisions, they're just power armor. So, 12 versus 10, obviously, as much as I like this one, this is just better, so, goodbye. Yeah, that's, I like to have it there still. Um, I'll click auxiliaries. Who has? Oh, I didn't delete them yet. There you go. It helps us out a little more manpower. I have a feeling they're going to go to war with us, so that's why we got to come down here, too. Uh, cool, yeah, absolutely. Hey, oh, yes, sir. Very nice. On civilian, civilian rest, great falls, trade nodes. Yeah, that's fine. Let's put down resistance all over the place here. Yeah, that'd be nice. Looks like we got quite a bit around here. Not ideal. Oh, see, I knew that'd happen. Cloud's Haven. Not bad. Part of the Missoula. I'm glad we got Missoula too. Begin a route. It's not bad. Yes, please. Yes, please. Now we're going to actually make some money now. Yay! Now hopefully, this doesn't get too bad for us, but you never know. Um, how many days would it take for them to justify against us? Oh, that's quite a few days. Okay. So we've got a little bit of time. Uh, let's build a Missoula then. We need money. Of course, we could also use arms manufacturers too. Yeah. We need more power armor and whatnot. The normal stuff. Yeah, seems about right. Standing up against us, pretty normal. What else we got here? Battle caps economy. You know what? We have no money. God dang it. I wish we had money. I like having money. Our Reavers. New coats. Twin buttes. Wait, hold on. Oh, we have manpower. We could have deployed these guys. Hey, great balls. I didn't realize this was a trade note either. Cool. Now we're going to make some more money. I love it. Do we really want here? Weapons expert. I like the 5% heart attack, soft attack, reliability. Recovery is also very good too. Do I, I rather want to hit them harder? Reconnaissance is only 10%. Description's not bad. Speed's not bad. It's only 3% though. Do I want to hit them harder or do I want to recover faster? You're not attacking anyway, so let's go Pound and Jack, why not? Pound and Jack Arena. Very cool. Good, good, good. Enter the soul. Reavers and new coats. Uh, trading times, not bad. The rain keeps me warm. The obelisk. 
that's not bad. Let's keep going with some more stuff. We haven't done a lot on this side here. Letting Thrift get to work. Letting Knight Thrift set up his proposed garage complex outside the bunker may be silly, but his conviction is undeniable. Given his past as a raider mechanic, he's bound to be speaking with some level of passion. In any case, a workshop like he suggests will jumpstart our military industry like nothing else would. Very good. We could clamp down on autonomy. Pandora's box. Hey, we've got 40 army XP. That's good. Uh, we are okay without that. The map we just had, well, it went bye bye immediately. Here it is. Get some more? No. Okay. Sad. Hey, look at that. Fantastic. Thank you. Oh, 98. That's quite a bit. Um. Good. Oh, hello. Hello. Well, I was not expecting this so fast, but alright then. Oh, I wish we kind of got, got warned of this, but again, I guess we weren't really paying attention now. Um, no, we're good. Oopsie. I rejected them. Oops. Anti tank. Armor speed. It's armor, though. Oiled up, lubed up. Well, it seems like that side could definitely wait. A power armor of stabilization. Many of the newbies have begun teaching one another about the power armor, increasing their efficiency and camaraderie on the field. Truly, they grow up so fast. Yeah. Aircraft company. Yeah. So how much will it take to core everything here? I feel like we get some bonuses to, if we try to core stuff, or we, we should wait to core stuff. I want it to be a bit quicker and faster, too. Not bad. Can you just go in anyways? Can you just go in too? You might be able to, maybe. No, we're good. Old Believers, Manitoba. Nice. Yeah, it seems like we're doing alright. That'd be a good one to take out. You got more experience, huh? Hey, Lost Hills Black Badge. Hey, fantastic. Thank you, Lost Hills, for the Brotherhood. Two more teams. Idiot Savant. Organization loss and moving is not bad either. Still, Life Giver is just more recovery rate. I love it. No, sir, I don't want this. Resource efficiency gain, breakthrough. Uh, let's see what this one's like. The Queen of the North. With the Enclave gone, Honor sets her sights on the further reaches of Montana and Washington. Behind her sisters rally, whatever allies have we face them united. We're doing well down there. Uh, we could probably do pretty well here, too. They're not very strong. And whatever we can, we're cutting down their strength. Which I do like, don't get me wrong. Ooh, are they forcing the defense there, too? I guess they're forcing the attack, but still. No, I don't want... Oh, oh, never mind. I do want this one. It keeps me warm. But let's read about something else first. Uh, I guess night cleanup service? Well, the scouts intel were marked a few spots on land that would be suitable for infrastructures. The problem being the rubble, rump, rubble, but Thrift claims he's got the perfect fix for that. He just needs a bit of C4 and authorization. But I was born head in the clouds in the lands of Arkansas, where the mountains were drowned in fog. My mother, Whisper of Rain, was my tribe stargazer. She read and recorded the fate written in the stars, to where every speckle of the night sky, from the moon to strings of stardust fire, had a purpose. 
I never saw her again out of the brother that stole me, alone in an unknown world of steel and battery. My mother's wisdom kept me grounded. It kept me loved. It reminded me to love. And without her, I would not be standing here without with my sisters of steel in these northern reaches. We vanquished smoke and mirrors, fought raiders and wraiths from our past, and more importantly, we forged a home for all peoples alike in infamy and family. So I devote this to you, mother, and to all those beside me. When a day comes where I perish, weathered or bloodied, I rest easy knowing that I was loved and that I loved. And that was enough to build a world. That's yeah, simple. Very simple. Ooh, and there goes those guys. Uh, we'd probably be more efficient if we did this and stop fighting over a river, but, you know, it is what it is. We've lost 25, which is not bad, versus 1,000. You know, we could be doing better, but still. Um, ooh, what do we have here? I wouldn't mind negotiator. More max planning would be very good, too. Zane Rock declared one of the Marshall Republic. Oh, yeah, we they, are, they do want to go to war and kill us off, don't they? Eh, hey, better end this war pretty soon, then. Ooh. I was going to say, like, we should probably stop attacking and, like, refocus our efforts, but still. At this point, I mean, I don't know if we really can afford to do that. You need that manpower. And power armor, too, but don't get me wrong, but still. No one's green overall. It's good for XP, and we should keep moving up through Kyle's spell. Hey, we might be able to cut him off from the capital. Go straight up north. This is going to be extremely risky, but it's all right. The way we like it. Risky. Nice. Good. Beat the crap out of them. Mm -hmm. Owens Washington, huh? Training time. Oh, uh, to train a sister. We've amassed more recruits and volunteers than we can count. The Paladin Minerva and the Paladin Joanna have requested to guide these recruits and volunteers through their homestead duties. Why not? Cut them off. Hopefully we don't get circled there. That would really suck. Oh, okay, they get they got there too. That's fine. Good. So we're gonna go branch out this way. We're slowly branching out this way too, which is good. It's just a giant mess. And we don't have enough divisions for this really to do this correctly or very well. But we're trying, man. We're trying really hard. We lost 64. We killed off 1,100. Pretty good casualty ratio. That's taking a while to get through here, isn't it? Oof. Hey, these guys are spread out though, which is not bad. Alright. Oh, and we're pushing into. Here, you go here. I want you to go up and around. Take out the nest, if you can, and circle destroy. Um, how much more are there? No. Oh, a walk in Cloud's Haven. On our notice, two things on a stroll around Cloud's Haven. The first was gratifying, the sisterhood effort to refurbish her capital is coming along smoothly. The second was strange, albeit pleasant. Everyone around her adored charming colors, namely in the form of chloral brooches. Floral brooches she didn't have, so after inquiring if you passed her by, Honor set off to mend them. Honor located one of Thrift's older workshops and poked her head through the door. Hello, she called. Joanna and Minerva were hunched over a workbench. There were three distinct piles on the table, one for flowers, one for patches, and the third for a completed brooches. Joanna jolted at Honor's presence. Honor, Warwick, lounging on a couch in the corner of the room, looked up from his book. Oh, Honor's here. Yeah, thanks for the look, uh, <laughs> Joanna grumbled flatly, chucking a half-finished brooch at her brother. The brooch fell short halfway across the room. Honor approached the workbench. What's all this? She smiled, picking up a flower from the table. Uh, just a little passion project. Originally, they were for the new recruits and volunteers to boost morale, but then it got carried away. Joanna blinked, slightly flustered, as she awkwardly pushed four brooches towards Honor. Uh, I couldn't decide what brooch would suit you more, so I made a few. My Honor beamed at the brooches. Well, I think I already have a favorite. A beautiful violet. A vibrant sunflower. An illustrious jasmine. An inviting primrose. Well, we need advanced components. Hmm. In all honesty, you know what? I think I'm going to go with uh, electricity, because even though we can build more, we're starting to run out. Oh! No wonder we're not doing as well. We're out of energy cells. I should have been more aware of that. Whoops. My bad. Um, we're going to do that too. Anyways. Well, we need more energy. Hmm. Well, we should probably ex 
using more resources, right? I mean, birthright. The children of the Beast Lords absorbed into the Brotherhood nearly a century ago have paid enough for the actions of their ancestors. These children only know pleasant tales. Their mothers and fathers living alongside the beasts of the wasteland. Let's carefully ease them back into old tradition and sands of cannibalism. That'd probably be good. Look at all this equipment. It would happen to be a power armor, but whatever. It is what it is. Living by the skin of our teeth, you know. Oh, uh, you know what? We're actually gonna grab this one too because we need that water. Hey, look at that. Nice. Of course, the capital's cut off, which is fantastic. Still, uh, oh. oh crap. Well, they're in their war too, so they're kind of suffering for the Marshall Republic. Oh boy. Come in. Please, I know it sucks. I know we have no energy cells to actually move the power armor, but still, please just move in. A's and right. Well, how much money do we have now? That's not enough. It's never enough. Never enough for me to boost. Go in. There you go. Oh boy. What? They want a territory? I don't think so. This is a direct rule from our, our capital. What, what's the capital again? That's oh, Cloud Haven. Fairview. Uh, well, we actually have enough divisions to help hold up the entire line here. I think they're going to lose these guys. I could be wrong. Basic training appointments. I think it's a claim stage. Sure, why not? Demand tribute? Mm, I don't think so. I mean, a birthright. A call not easily forgotten. Although scanned, the descendants of the Beast Lords exhibit minor psychic control over creatures. Some have shown interest in exploring this ability. It'd be of great use to our cause. Let's give them this chance. Return of the Wilds. Recently, patrols have recorded an influx of stray dogs wandering into our territories. None of them were hostile, just friendly. We have other descendants of the Beast Lords taking these dogs, all of whom were overjoyed at the opportunity. Mm. Commune with the gods. Out of the latest string of successes, the Reavers have requested for the clearance to our other technologies. But for too long, they have been separated with their gods. Let us restore this privilege. Oh, look at that. Fantastic. Uh, do we have... Oh, look at that war goal still against you. You're probably going to lose. It's only 20 days, though. We can help accelerate their loss. Economic advisors, toothpick. Eh, this one's okay. Scribe Arthur's okay. Toothpick, it's not much. It kind of goes along with the breakthrough idea. Um, can we core anything here? Maybe? 36, not much. Middlemark Grand Reopening. Well, while Middlemark uh, has been open to the public, their store zero location in Calgary has always sent out signals discussing a Grand Reopening, um, urging customers and curious prospects and sorts alike to go and take a look at their vast array of discounted luxuries and must-have items. Second, of course, also urges customers to not feel intimidated by the Raider employed there, or Raiders employed there, saying their body has been entirely removed. The signal is probably followed by an apology regarding the assault of his customer who claimed to be a warden of the white. Wow, I can't wait to go. Hey, look at that manpower now. Finally, we got a decent amount of manpower. Uh, now we're doing slightly better on energy cells, even because we're not moving. Uh, we're still out 500. Not ideal. It is what it is. We'll do that. As we commune with the gods. Uh, you know what? Let's get some more political power maybe next. The obelisk chantry. A chantry that sanctions practices of all cultures and general social events have been a popular idea among the sisters. With the words of the enclave later rest, we will be in construction of the obelisk chantry. Of course, why not? No, we're good. We are ideal. Oh, yes, please. Can I request manpower from them? Oh, we don't need it. We could request forces, but we don't need their forces. So we're gonna get, get these guys. Kind of glass. Oh, come on. Do better than this. Yeah, 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 we'll get a scavenging team. Yeah, you yeah. know. Even I give them vault. Scavengers come down, tell me. You know, we'll go and do that. Why not? Return of the Wilds. Get your support. And we'll do full scale wholesale approval. Three of successful endeavors have earned a more say on infrastructure organization and construction. It's approached with more ideas of expanded research horizons. Let's proceed. 
Resource wise, hey, 27 is good. 29 is not bad. That's got even better too. So after this one, we're going to check out, yeah, Chantry. Hunger for, I want more events. Encryption is pretty nice. Bottle caps. Middle mark, Yellowstone, that's good. Artisan hammers, construction speed, 15% is pretty good. Scribe Augustine, of the few scribes devoted to the sisters since before the rebellion, has shown interest in bolstering your defenses using artisan techniques. He has requested resources for an extensive study. It came to me in a dream, he told us. I see a strong defense line crafted with artisan perfection. Well, he hasn't failed us before. Mm -hmm. Sure, we'll do that one. Well, I guess we could take just technically go in. We won't get very much from it. That's all right. We never did war with the Marshal Republic, but that's okay. That's what you get for wanting to come kill us, too. Just something out. And we can grab from our army XP, too. Oh, I forgot about the planes. Air bases? Yes. Alright, then. Bowman, huh? Oh, we got encircled. Look at that. Oh, that sucks. And we're no longer encircled. Oh, the true cons, huh? Under Essen. Yeah, that's a bit long. Heaven's Gate. I don't think we have anything there. No, the old country. It's fine. Do the state that we know that we have cores on them and whatnot. Song of a sister, a sister lover, a friend, the path grows wild and kept. Let fire streak the sky, a centered light warms the plains. From ash may we find her again, a sister lover, a friend. The dawn is forged by her sword, molten words, molten earth, molten hearts. The dawn is forged by her sword. Cool. Principle, purity. I don't think purity would really make sense for us in this campaign. Not gonna lie. Principle. Walking tanks. Yeah. That one seems very good. Not working? Nice. Cool. Hey, you know, I'll just take whatever we can from these guys. Okay, we're gonna take way more than I thought we'd be able to. Can we take all this? No, maybe not. This is okay, this is radically way more than I thought we'd... We're taking everything from them. Did we do everything in the war? Holy cow. I have a feeling they're going to kind of come and kill us next. Is Rapid City a trade? No, no, it's not. It's as one of these. Oh, Bismarck was. Holy cow. Do we have any caps yet? Only 165. That's not much. Uh, military setting bonuses? Yes, please. As much as I want to do this in care package, I want more actual manpower. Um, come over here. Do that one. Yes, please. Divisions are strong. I love it. Oh, we can restore a cabin creek, solar farm too. All right, so we got Great Falls. I know I got plenty of political power that I'm not really using very much right now. Slowly start continuing to core more stuff. Don't get me wrong, but still, we'll get there. Are there any claims on you guys? I don't think so. Well, we can do it anyways. Why not? Scam just found something. We need time to. Put down resistance one out too, so. Silo on the hill. Hey, hey. Rising skylines. As their territory grows, abandoned ruined buildings come in abundance. A sister would not be without their craftiness. We can strip these older buildings for resources that and build something better. Why not? We are nothing if not with each other. Oh look at that. Uh, most of the civilians we have absorbed do not understand the ways and beliefs of the sisterhood. Our exemplary sisters can amend that. We'll send most our our most influential down to town squares. Them. The people know what we fight for. I think I read this one last time, but a gander over the fence. Having regained foothold within the Montana chapter, it would not hurt to establish production near borders. I also provides with great leeway to see what neighbor, nations are up to. Go and train, because we're going to need to. Yeah. 
No, we're good. Construction is still opening up. What are, do we have at least... We have 35 military factories. That's not bad. Are we out of infantry equipment? Oh, we are. That's not good. Oh, and the Jacksons demand territory. Okay. Interesting. Well, come here, then. I'll beat the crap out of you, then. These guys seem decently strong. That Neil Jackson, they don't have a lot of manpower. Roughly balanced, same divisions we've got. Alright, then. We'll see. And we're going to pour this tile to 49. Well, 110 days, that's a bit too much for me. Please attack us. Please attack us. I'd love to go to war with you. Alright, I got excited for no reason here. Yeah. Arlo Town. Hey, they did go to war with us. Look at that. Now, can we do that and do okay? Let's take a look see. Where are we at? Got a lot of divisions all around. I'm looking for holes to exploit. It looks like I just found one. Here. If we can do that. That'd be fantastic. Yes, please. Gander over the fence. Wow. All right. I'd rather you guys go this way. Oh, they're definitely dying there. I love it. Oh, we got the separate done too. Yeah, that's perfect. I forgot we had all this stuff going on too. Or we just go for all the victory points. That could work as well. Four versus the 400 casualties? Not good enough for us. Ooh, that's nice. Good. Over here. I know they're spreading out a whole bunch, but it is what it is, whatever. I go here. Seems like a fun place to be. Buffalo? Yeah, there you go. Thank you for playing. Well, that was a nice little distraction. Mm, we should probably also improve our power armor if we possibly can. Okay, maybe we can't. All right, you know we'll do that anyways. Why not? Ah, mending sorrows. So easily do we forget who suffers most from war and brutal skirmishes. Morale among the workers have waned by the leaders and tolls of our expansion. Let's do what we can to uplift their spirits and motivation. Oh, the Pax Americana now. Well, how about something too? Hey, Rosebud. We got Rosebud. Great. Steam powder extraction? Why not? Rosebud. Oh! We got all the trade nodes. I love it. Oh. How's Missoula doing? I know I want to expand this one. Cloud Savings looking alright. Billings, Great Falls. Yeah, we should be raking in some serious money here, hopefully. Many sorrows, okay. Uh, the auditions begin. Paladin and Joanne has expressed a great interest in reintroducing re theater to the Sistra, a form of entertainment she had learned about from the bunker. Her requests to hold auditions have been met with mixed reactions. Some puzzles, others have humored her, and a few have shown genuine interest in participating. Whatever the case, the ordeal is boosting morale, so why not? Seems like they got quite a few divisions. Yellowstone, Old Country, Marshall Republic, Yellowstone, Old Country, Passkeepers? No. Brotherhood, yeah. Oh, they're too far away. Darn it. Heaven's Gate. Timberline, nah. Oh, we're going to be fighting these in really crappy territory, aren't we? True Cons. I'd rather beat up the True Cons, in all honesty. Rad Hazard, Safe Haven, Middlemark. We can go to war with Middlemark later on, too. Um, division, they have more divisions than us, it appears. Uh, kind of, sort of. 100, 2.3. Uh, 
This would probably be better to do. 60. Tiny bit more steel. It's nice. Machine encrypted. Let's see. Immediately start working for us. And we go to war by when. Oh, and there goes Tlaloc. Goodbye, Tlaloc. Hey, voting up even more, which is good. Radio protection is nice. Yes. Well, let's see. What happens if we do go to war with them? You know what? Just in case, let's save. Let's save. It's always safe to save. Only 54 monies. Never enough caps. They immediately start attacking us. We can start doing that to them. Yes, we can. Start winning here, too. And Lost Hills will help us out as well. Until they go to war as well, but, you know, whatever. You know what? Don't help them out. You go there. Do that. And get all the way to Gillette. And go there to there. Some sort of encirclement would be beneficial for us. Oh, god dang it. They showed up with more divisions. Okay. Here, go here. Go here. Trap shacks. More output, yes. Free kind of filtration is very good to have. And we're going to lose 10% of recruitable population factor, but that's worth it for what we got here. We're struggling, though. Definitely struggling. Joanna's pre rehearsal log. A flat tone buzzes for a minute, uh, then the feedback cuts. There's a click. Two voices murmur over each other. As this thing on, uh, Joanna's uh, voice cuts and clear. Darn, you carry this everywhere? Yeah, for good thoughts. For, good for the thoughts, Han. And also, you can tell by the red light. Muffled fumbling interrupts. Warwick. Whoa, careful. There's a clack, then a moment of awkward silence. Got it, Joanna chuckles weakly. Warwick sighs deeply in the distance. All right, now scoot, get. Warwick mumbles something unintelligible before the door closes. All right, Joanna's log. Super excited for the theater. Most of the roles have been set. Elizaveta came by the other day. She makes perfect sense. Andy giving her, gave her the role instantly. Minerva's playing a several background characters since we're short on those. Might be hard since she, there's no spotlight material. So, she is spotlight material. Thrift's handling special effects, but he said he'd be down to play the coach. Honor says she's coming. It's a little nerve-wracking, but that means we've got to bring her best. Now, I just need to decide who will play Danny. There's a pause and a guess. <gasps> Wait, I know exactly who. The audio recording ends. Warwick put on the leather jacket. More recovery and stability. Nice. Oh, well, uh, bringing the, you know what, bringing the Broadway home. By everyone's surprise, the auditions went smoothly. Paladin and Joanna is ready to take her chosen actors into the rehearsal stage. We've cleared out a storage house for a stage and have provided the resources for props. Whispers of excitement have sped through the chapter. Everyone has their eyes on this Broadway. Let's ensure Joanna succeeds. We want to be successful, man. Who does not want to be successful here? Nice. Help him out. Go here. No, stay here. No, sir, we don't need you for this. Probably. We're doing well. And we made an one here, too. Wasn't playing on this one, but whatever. Um, Shukans. Yellowstone. That'd be good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we definitely want to record this. Letters for the after show. Dearest Joanna, at the end of your lovely show, a dilemma was brought to my attention. And thus I left without exchanging my heartfelt thoughts. So I write to you now before I'm dragged away abruptly. I adored your setup. You wrangled up your set of actors and stage crew. Well, I can see it in their eyes. They love performing as much as you did directing. I await your next show, as does the rest of your audience. Regards, head in the clouds. Additionally, do praise whoever styled Elizaveta's hair and costume in the final act. I hardly recognized her. Thanks so much for the praise, Sentinel. It means a lot coming from you. I'm still in the studio, but the power's flickering, so please pay no mind to my crooked lines from his spelling. Apparently, Warwick flung his leather jacket at such a precarious angle that he struck a stage light, and then that stage light fell, and that's where I'll spare you the intricacies. The feedback was overwhelming, and I've already started to think about what you could we, what we could do next. Perhaps we could talk about it later on, on a later note when you're not busy. Thanks again, Joanna. And so the evening came to a close. 
rigid, rigid measures. Since arriving here in Montana, we face several accounts of disorder on behalf of the locals. It's time to banish the demons and institute a proper sense of order into these people. Establishing a proper policing force and overwatch will help in aid peacekeeping endeavors. I've never played that game. Yeah, it looks like we're doing pretty well. Wow, we got suicidal here? If the AI was smart, they could easily kill us. Alright. You know what? You might be able to do that. You go right there. You might be able to make another encirclement and destroy them too. And you might be able to help them out too. Ah, they're Mexicans. Free fighters, as some would call them. But what if we just go to Rapid City? Oh, oh they're being smart. Okay. They're attacking... Attacking us back. And we've been circled. But we did do that too. Oh, okay. I actually lost a division. Oh, that's not good. Well, they're learning. The AI is learning. I made a mistake. My fault. Completely. You didn't see that. Yeah. You know what? If they're gonna fight and die. They're gonna die and fight hard. I'm gonna force it. Good. My bad. Losses we should not have had. That's my fault. I should have paid more attention. But then again, they do have reinforcements from other p people. Mendoza's Casket. Mendoza's Casket is a bit of a local legend. An old police station was co-opted by the National Guard and made into a treasure trove of an armory. Though it's said whatever is inside is legendary, it is, of course, guarded by centuries-old security systems and booby traps. Sending a team will take some time, maybe incur some losses, but it could pay off. Good, kill them off. Just kill them off. We've lost 300. Unacceptable. Absolutely unacceptable. Go here to here. And we've got to go again. And just go in there anyways. Thank you very much. Good. Keep these Mexicans in place. Keep these guys in place. They do not deserve to live. You know, the usual. Especially after what they did to that other division. They absolutely do not deserve to live. Come on. Cut them completely off. You know, we division's trapped, but still. Good. Keep killing them off. All of them off. Okay, thank God. Oof. My bad. Playing it risky. Very risky. Yeah, we're looking pretty good. We've had a pretty successful episode, I'd say. I really don't want to fight these guys, because... I hate fighting in the really wonky mountains and whatnot, personally. It's kind of like rivers, sort of-ish. It's kind of not very fun fighting here. But it is what it is. And we'll deal with it. Of course, you have to fight through them so you can get through them, so you don't have to fight them, in them anymore. Who would have thought? There you go. Oh. I mean, this is Casket, the stockpile. Though the inside of the station was dangerous, some soldiers were wounded. They managed to bring back some of the treasure before it collapsed. What are they managed to secure? Power armor? Oh, I'm going to absolutely take that power armor. Hey, because we have more than enough infantry equipment now. It's power armor that we're missing. Scrapping old robots. In the h, &H factory, there's plenty of old robots we had to clear out on our way in. Well, the paladins have them set aside. We can put, set our focus on scrapping a few of them to repurpose their assets for our own needs, hopefully. A steel chair and a small source mint will be able to make use of it. Yeah. This is what's good, too. Um... You know what? Great Falls. Oh, sorry. I'm pressing there too. That'd be good. Next place we can invest. Yeah, this area wouldn't be bad. To get start working on it this side too. We have no manpower. It's pretty normal for us. What if we did that? Would they attack us? Yes, they would. I like how it turned green immediately. I like how it flipped over too. 100 losses, not bad. Scrapping old robots, very good. A threat approach to minor inconveniences? 
Now, rock garbage and uh, <clears throat> debris, that's a tough crowd, huh? And nobody wants to be the guy who has to manually lift and carry all those sad rocks away, so let's say every guy's a back pain and think smarter, think last year. Sentinel Honor was informed that despite everyone's best attempts to stop threat from throwing unauthorized explosive around, the night already had a t ticking bomb in his hand and nobody was willing to take it away. They don't want to keep attacking us, I'm okay with it. Let them attack us. No sir, I don't want you. I'm sorry. Not really. Hey, look, 100%. Okay, we have to do that one. So if no one's going to attack us... Oh, never mind. They are attacking us. Good, let them. Not nearly getting the results I really wanted, but, you know, it is what it is. Oh, you're attacking. Well, I guess we can help support the attack. Why not? Port St. Anthony, huh? Yeah, do something about that. There you go. Yeah, it's good. Exploiting Ver Fort Verity. Despite local interference with their operations, we can maybe make some mutually progressive developments, improving quality of life for our men and nearby civilians, at the very least, enough to make them back off and save our am ammunition. Might as well bow. Let's see what you can do. Power line repairs. Since we can send out knives to work on uh, setting up and maintaining the old power lines in and around Fort Verity. While we won't have much of a hold on energy yet, it'll undoubtedly improve any powered infrastructure. Knowing the enemy. I know the big guns back home would have a piss on all things Raider, but they work for a reason. Montana's new. It's foreign. It can buy us when we least expect. So why don't we use this thing at all in our disposal? From th Thrift Knight. Nice. That would be very good as well. Um, planes? We've not developed planes for a while, but we've got other stuff we can develop too. So I'll have two at a time. Um, we're going to need some of these. Yeah, we're definitely going to need some of these guys too. For boys out just a little bit here. Alright, come to you. Oh, god dang it. I always forget to do these. Go. Cut off, look at that. Who would have thought that? Oh, cool. Keep it up. Yellowstone would be nice to have. Yellowstone is a nice place to be. Irrigation, nice. Up top of the manpower a little bit here and there, you know. Uh, cleaning up old rifles. We found a cache of old war weaponry. Though ancient and far from our style, Thrift has excuse potential in augmenting the rifles to our standards. We certainly could provide them the means. Demolitions, acquisitions. I'm gonna put it simply. We need boom. We're running low on the things that make boom. Let's get more, please. From Night Thrift. And uh, moving around is a funny thing, really. Through uh, Thrift's constant material requests, we become more aware of the inefficiency of our old transportation methods. We'll need to look into tightening cargo security for our future endeavors, of course. Gateway. Gateway's a fun nation to play as. Quite fun, really. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, my bad. There you go, she pretty much guarantee us victory. Good. Oh, we got defeated, huh? Too bad. Kill them harder. Nice. We have definitely grown a huge amount. My god. Oh, big grass is pretty big. Big and, and grass and... 90 days is not bad. Cool. 
But I might just end here. This has actually turned out really, really well for us. Um, Sisters of Steel so far has been very strong, and I think we got at least one more episode in us to really figure out what else we're going to do with the Sisters of Steel with Sentinel Honor. But hey, if you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you tomorrow. And also see what else we can do with the good old sisters. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great honor rest of your day.